हे फ्रेंड्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल दिस वीडियो इज ऑल अबाउट फिक्सिंग द इशू विद होगवर्स लेगेसी वे यू एफपीएस इज कीप्स ऑन ड्रॉपिंग और यू आर नॉट गेटिंग डिजायर्ड एफपीएस सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग टाइम लेट्स गो हेड एंड प्रोसीड विद द रेजोल्यूशन लेट्स प्रोसीड विद द बेसिक स्टेप राइट क्लिक ऑन स्टार्ट मेन्यू एंड चूज द ऑप्शन रन टाइप हेयर रेज एडिट एंड हिट द एंटर की नाउ इन एड्रेस बार you need to paste a path which i will share you in the description of this video paste the path and hit the enter key now in this right pane you need to find a key with the name hwsch mode if it is not available like at my end it is not available you can go ahead and create it by right clicking and choose the option new divert 32 bit value and give it a name hwsch mode Double click to open it, and in value data give it a value two, and hit the OK button. This way we have enabled the GPU hardware acceleration. Once it is done, restart your PC and then try to play the game. Now if FPS is still dropping in Hogwarts Legacy, let's proceed with the second step. In second step, you need to open up the control panel of your NVIDIA. From here, first of all, click on 3D settings. and you will find the option of vertical sync go ahead and turn it off as it is shown right over here after turning off the v sync go ahead and again in 3d settings you will find the option of shader cache make sure you reduce the shader cache size to be 10 gb as it is showing right over here once you have done these two settings don't forget to restart your pc to fix the fps drop in hogwarts legacy Now, if this also fails, let's proceed with the next step. Open up your browser, and I will share you a link of this website. From here, you need to download NVIDIA DLS 3.1.1. Click on this download button. Choose any server to download it into your PC. Save it onto your desktop. Once it is saved, go ahead, open, and unzip the file present inside it. Now here is the file that we have just unzipped. You need to right click on it and choose the option copy. After copying the file, you need to paste the file in the directory of your Hogwarts Legacy inside the Nvidia folder. I do not have an Nvidia GPU, that's why I will share you the complete path, which is this PC, C drive, program files 86, Steam, Steam apps. common hogwarts legacy from here the next path for you is open the engine folder then plugins then runtime then nvidia then dlss then binaries then third party and then win64 you need to paste the file into the win63 folder by right clicking on it and choose the option paste and if it is asking you to replace any file go ahead and replace it once the file is pasted your dlss is updated to fix out the fps drop generally the step 3 and step 4 combining help you to fix the fps drops in hogwarts legacy now let's proceed with the fourth step right click on start menu and choose the option run in run command type local app data percentage and hit the enter key now here open hogwarts legacy folder open save config windows no editor and here find a file with the name engine.ini Once you have find this file, again I have this text that I have created just to fix the FPS drop. I'll share this text in the description of this video. Select the text, right click and choose option copy. Now to the engine file, right click and choose open with Notepad. Scroll to the last and at the end. simply right click and paste the data as it is that we have just copied now click on the file menu and choose the option save now close it go ahead and restart your pc and this will completely fix the fps drops while playing hogwarts legacy in your windows pc and last step is to click on the start menu and type advanced system settings open the application now under advanced tab click on the option settings again choose advanced tab 
and under virtual memory click on the option change from here uncheck the option automatically manage paging file size now next step you need to do is to whichever drive your game is installed simply select that drive c d or e depending upon the installation directory of the game once selected hit the no paging file and hit the set button now hit the yes button over here once it is done now go ahead and choose a larger drive than your c drive suppose i'll go ahead and choose drive d once it is selected now click on the option system manage size and click on the option set once it is set go ahead hit the okay button now okay restart your pc and this will completely fix out the issue of low fps while playing the hogwarts legacy in your windows pc so this is all about it friends if this video works out for you i request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel thank you so much friends thank you for watching